Hi everybody, this is Arkady Frechman. I'm a New York City personal injury trial attorney. And today I wanted to tell you a story about a consultation I just did with one of my clients. And this is a nice lady and she's actually from a different state, so not New York. And she has an attorney handling her case, but she's really you know, concerned because the lawyer isn't calling her back and she's having a lot of issues. And also it's admittedly you know, not a trial lawyer, not somebody who has any experience going to court. But, you know, she feels the lawyer is trying, he's working hard on her case. And so she called me for a consultation and then, you know, we were chatting and I said, look, if you'd like, I can give you my local partner in your state and you can just talk to this lawyer. And the person I gave her is actually an excellent trial lawyer who's had verdicts for 8 million, 12 million, you know, crazy numbers. Almost every single case he touches is a million dollar case. So I thought, you know, maybe she'd be interested in either hiring him or if not hiring him, at least having a consultation. And she did have a consultation, but at the end of it all, you know, she decided, you know, I'm going to stay with my original lawyer, which is completely fine. You know, I don't want to pressure anyone. And like I said before, in many videos, I don't want to take cases from other lawyers. I really prefer the fresh cases, meaning the cases where people do not have a lawyer. But today she starts texting me again. And she says something to the effect of, when is my deposition gonna be? And I said, look, I don't know because I'm not, I don't have your file in front of you, right? I'm not handling the case. I just gave you that consultation. I'm happy to help, but I can't tell you when your deposition will be. You have to ask that lawyer. And remember like when I gave you the other lawyer, well, that lawyer was a trial lawyer. And so she says two things that I thought were really interesting. Number one, she says, well, my lawyer said that he's not a trial lawyer, but that if the case has to go to trial, that he knows other trial lawyers and those trial lawyers could maybe step in and help. Okay, that makes sense, I guess, but the problem becomes that why do you wanna hire somebody who can't handle the case soup to nuts? You know, they can't do everything A to Z. If the person is not really a trial lawyer and just the fact that he can find a trial lawyer, but whoever he finds, at the 11th hour, right before trial, is not gonna know anything about your case. So now this trialer is gonna to have to learn your case at the 11th hour, you know, kind of like cramming for an exam. That's never gonna go well, as opposed to having a trial lawyer all along who could learn your human story, who can come to your house, who could really meet your family, your friends, your neighbors, your coworkers, you know, really know your doctors, get know your file for two, three years, and then he'll step or she'll step foot in the courtroom. It's a lot more powerful for you. So I didn't really understand that. I even said, look, it's like, for example, if I need, you know, would you, would you, if you need, let's say a heart surgery, would you hire me? Well, I'm not a heart surgeon. I've never even done any kind of surgery, but my neighbor He's a really good cardiothoracic surgeon. It's like, you know, hire me, I'll be your heart surgeon. I don't know anything about surgery. I'm not a doctor. I've never operated on the heart, but my neighbor across the street, let's hope he's home. <laughs> let's, not, let's, let's hope he's home. He's a really good cardiothoracic surgeon, right? It's kind of silly. It's like, so that's number one. And number two, she says, well, I'm really worried about going to trial because I just heard that you could lose. And that's true. I mean, you could lose, right? But I think that the, the problem with that kind of thinking and that kind of analysis is that if you don't have a trial lawyer who's preparing the case for trial, then you're never going to get a maximum settlement. That's like wishful thinking, right? That's like thinking, well, the insurance company will be fair. I had a real case. I wasn't at fault. I did have, you know, back surgery or I did have a serious injury. So the insurance company is just going to give me millions of dollars. Well, if you've watched any of my videos, and I think we've made hundreds of them over the last 10 plus years, you'll know that is baloney. The insurance company is not gonna be fair. There's no equity. They're not looking out for your best interest. They're a for-profit business. And what they wanna do is make as much money as possible and pay you nothing or as little as possible. So the only way to, you know, to, to get the maximum settlement is to prepare the case for trial as if you're going to trial, dotting your I's, crossing your T's, doing subpoenas, having all the medical records, having all the experts, and them seeing that you have a real trial lawyer on board, right? Because then if you do all that, what the insurance company will say is, look, we're in a corner. If we don't pay a million dollars, well, they're gonna go to court and they're gonna hit us for two. So they're gonna pay you a million dollars. But if you're afraid to do that, right? I, I even said to her, look, you don't have to do it. You're the client. Just have the lawyer, the trial lawyer do it for you. 
But if, if, if the client is afraid to get a trial lawyer to do it for her and she's just expecting a settlement, there's not really any other option, right? The only other option is to take a low ball settlement. So that's unfortunately reality. So I just wanted to put that out there. You know, I don't want to use, I don't want to give any specifics about cases. I want to keep all consultations confidential, but sometimes I talk to people and I feel like there are lessons here, right? Lessons that other people should hear that could be helpful for the public. And that's why I'm getting ideas from these consultations for videos. So I hope this was helpful to you, but I feel like, you know, those are some interesting, um, you know, reasons not to hire a trial lawyer. Um, so tell me what you think. Uh, okay. Thank you so much. We are here for you. Our goal is helping serious injury victims and families. Um, you know, text us. You could text me for a private consultation, 347-566-9595. It's totally confidential and it's free. Um, you know, and we're just here to help. Like if I could just chat with you and tell you what I think, then I'll do that. Like I've had a lot of consultations last week and a lot of the people, you know, some of the people didn't have lawyers, some of the people did, and some of the people had lawyers that I knew, and I told them, that's a good lawyer. Stay with your lawyer, he or she knows what they're doing, they're excellent, in fact, some of the lawyers I know, and, you know, I won't tell them that, you know, the person called me, because that's not, it's the attorney-client privilege, but I tell the client, hey, you have a great lawyer, you're in good hands. Sometimes people, you know, might need a change, or they might just not have a lawyer and need a lawyer. But, and sometimes people just need advice or they're in a different state and they need a consultation with somebody local just to answer some questions and, you know, uh, to, to put their mind at ease or to, uh, to learn something about their case or about the path, right? What they have to do in order to succeed in their case. So I hope this was helpful, but our goal is, like I said, helping serious injury victims and families we don't uh, think about, you know, making money ourselves. What we're, 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 we're really trying to do is help people. And that's what I think the legal profession has to be uh, in order to have a good name and in order for lawyers to um, be just good people, good lawyers, you know, helping others. And then there won't be that many lawyer jokes. <laughs> okay, everyone, have a great day. Let us know what you think. Uh, please like and subscribe to our channel. Feel free to text us, leave us a comment. We try to answer every comment. And if you need a personal consultation, just text me. Okay, have a great day. Bye-bye.